From the News Channel 5 Network, I'm Adam Hammond with your morning headlines this Monday. A man is in the hospital after getting shot by a bounty hunter, but he wasn't the one with a warrant. We're waiting to hear if there will be charges filed. This all happened on Jefferson Street and 9th Avenue North in Nashville Sunday afternoon. The bounty hunters chased that suspect into a Popeye's parking lot and one of the hunters shot the wrong man in the neck. That victim went to the hospital but is expected to be okay. The other person in the car was not hurt. We're hearing from the mayor following an officer involved shooting in Nashville. Mayor Briley says he spent time with the family of Officer Samuel Galuzzi at the hospital Saturday night. I'll sure Sean Dillon is accused of shooting Officer Galuzzi outside a Bordeaux apartment complex Friday. Two other officers fired back at Dillon, killing him. Galuzzi is now in stable condition following surgery, and Mayor Briley said, quote, I know that all of Nashville will join me in thanking Officer Galuzzi for his service and his sacrifice. The Preds are preparing for their home opener with cookies. Today, Kevin Fiala and Nick Bonino will work the window out at Christie Cookies on, on 12 South. They're going to be there from 430 to 530, and half of the sales will benefit the Predators Foundation. But don't forget, the puck drop is at Smashville at 7 o'clock tomorrow night. Now let's get a check on our forecast with Heather. It is going to be another hot day here across the Mid-South. Temperatures close to 90 degrees, so still feeling a whole lot like summertime, but there is relief in sight in the seven day. A high today around 88 winds out of the south at five miles per hour for tonight. Mostly clear with those lows falling to right around 70. Looking ahead to the rest of your work week by Wednesday, a cold front moves through. That's going to dramatically drop our temperatures by the end of the week in the lower 70s. I'm meteorologist Heather Mathis. Have a great day.